final sand and first coat of sealer day. Get everything cleaned out, cleaned up, sanded, rough sand as much as I'm going to do. And now I'm going to sand it with 120 grit with my palm sander, which may seem like a suicide mission, but I don't know. I'm going to save a little money and tough it out. I don't want to rent a drum sander because I would rent the drum sander, sand it, put on our sealer, and then I'm going to sand it in between every coat so I can get it nice and smooth. I'm just going to do it with my palm sander. Today's the day. All right, a little later in the day, I sanded the whole thing with 120. I didn't want to show you that. It's boring. I'm ready for my first coat of sealer. I've swept it too. I swept it three times. Wood floors are a pain. Trying to do wood floors is a real big pain. Maybe new floors are easy. These haven't been that easy. I hope she likes it. Taking it easy, not getting dressed. <laughs> All right, there's one full coat. <clears throat> we'll let this dry. It's safe for 24 hours. But as dry as this wood is, and as fast and as quickly as it's soaking it up, I think it'll be, I don't know, I think by the end of this evening, it's 1.30, 2 o'clock right now. I think by this evening, I think it'll be ready to go. I'm ready to walk on, frankly. And then um, we'll get back from church tomorrow. I will sand it. And we'll put coat number two on. That'll be 24 hours. Coat number two. I think I'm going to put three coats on of the regular. I'm just going to tell you what we're using. We're using water locks. It's tongue oil. Um, I don't know. I've gotten some opinions on whether or not to use it. And I I'm doing it. We've used uh, water locks on several other projects and they've all turned out real good. That's what we're putting on our trim. So on the window trim, uh, that's what we're putting on there. We're, we're using that on all the doors and all the, all the woodwork so far we've used water locks and that's what I'm using on the floor. So again, if it turns out like crud, we'll put carpet over it. I don't know, but I don't think it's going to, 
So uh, I put four coats on the closet and it just didn't get as glossy as I wanted it to. So I bought a gallon of high gloss. So I'm thinking three coats are regular, one coat of high gloss, and we'll see how it goes. What I'll probably do is I'll get to the third coat of the regular, see how it looks, and then over in the corner or something, I'll put high gloss on it, let it dry, and see what we got. Or I could put, I'm gonna put high gloss on the closet. It has four coats of regular on it. Uh, put that coat of high gloss on it, and we'll see if the if the floor here doesn't completely look like the closet. No big deal because it's a closet. But I'm hoping I can get away with three coats of regular and one coat of high gloss. But man, I mean, I don't know if you can tell. You can see a wet one right there that hasn't completely soaked it up yet. But the rest of these boards, I mean. No kidding. You could hear the wood. You could hear the wood sucking the, <laughs> sucking that tongue oil up. It is amazing how dry it, this wood is. So I think this will be good. The tongue oil gets into the pores, soaks it up and kind of gives it a, I don't know. I would call it a drink, but I don't know if that's right, but it's uh it's gonna condition the wood a little bit better than if you were to just go over it with a poly or something like that. So I don't know, they look pretty good so far. See you tomorrow for coat two. How's it going down there? Just drinking my tea. Watching you work. Just putting in a hard day's work. Day two of uh, floor. I'm going to sand it again, light sanding with some 120 grit and then put on the second coat. So, so far, I think it looks pretty sweet. What do you think? I like it. You're doing a great job. <laughs> Keep up the good work. It's Super Bowl Sunday and I'm working. I don't really care about the Super Bowl, but I'm working. I know I get his flack. Keep talking, let's edit that out. <laughs> Here we go. All right, coat two is finished. So I'll show it to you wet, so maybe this is what it'll turn out to look like when I put the last coat of high gloss finish on. We shall see. So today's the day. Last day, final day, last coat I'm putting on. It's starting to look pretty good, everybody. Here's what we got. Thus far, closet is done. I'm not putting any more in the closet. Look at that shine. My last coat is high gloss.
Fourth and final coat has been applied. We'll let it dry. We'll show you what it looks like once this is cured up. Mm -hmm. 